main purpose is to demonstrate how to do the assemble for the DR900. So basically, when you open the box, you will see this user user driver, user manual, initial manufacture certificates. Okay, we take out this, and then you will get your DR900. So how to assemble and do the simple setting is you take it out, screwdriver, screw up both screws, okay, then there will be a battery column. They are using normal standard double E batteries. So here we provided the batteries. So for your understanding, the battery usually can last for at least one year. And then if you need to change the battery, please make sure you are changing to either Panasonic or Energizer because or else you will be suffering some of the insufficient of power supply. So it will turn off by itself. And then make sure when you are doing the battery changing, you are change directly for four pieces directly. Don't using two news and two old. And then because if we are insufficient of power distribution, it might cause a lithium leak. And then it will spoil the PCB board. Okay, once you're done, screw it back. This is how it looks. Okay, we can switch on the lights and then option. So now we try to do some pre program, which is how we use it. So basically, we can press out and press option to all programs, and then you can find there is 110 programs already programmed inside this DR900. Okay, so we select for the COD high range. And then we press start and then in simple you need to re you no need to repeat the, the previous step in order to find out this cod basically you can press option and then you can add this particular program into your favorite so now we try to find this out okay we go to other programs okay we simply select aluminium and then now we want to change we want to change back the programs from the aluminiums to cod high range so in simple way just press the option favorite and user program and then cod is here so you just press start uh, so you will come back to the cod program okay and then some other features is like data lock previously what you have done uh, for this one i do a simple testing on this equipment so there is a previous result here so you can see previous result uh, 392 uh, 141 and then 1307 so this is a data logger so you can still trace back what is your operators doing but then maximum it only can store up to 100 data after that you will auto override and then Okay, absorbance advanced option that is for you to do some changing okay so this is the basic overall functions lah for the dr900 i will remaining the battery inside so when you receive you just turn on and then you can use it so to shut off press the on off button so you will directly turn off okay so thank you later we will be teaching you how to conduct the cod testing